been a long journey. You feel like you now belong. Contract gets extended, so it's a show of faith from the club. Yeah, definitely. Um, I'm ex extremely grateful for the club and um, all the support they've shown over the years. And um, I think early on it definitely didn't pan out how I would have liked with injuries and, and whatnot. But um, no, as I said, extremely grateful and um, really looking forward to the future ahead. So where do you feel better, better place now to be an AFL footballer, besides just being fitter? Um, yeah, I suppose it's, it's a lot of things that come into it. and. Um, I've worked really hard on my body and, and different things like that to, um, to get up to standard and um, I suppose a few of those injuries were sort of, I couldn't really do much about, they sort of just, just happened and, um, but yeah, as I said, I've, I've worked really hard on, on my body and um, I'm feeling really confident and um, yeah, really keen. What's to say that you've got such an important role now in that midfield that they've backed you in that way? Yeah, it definitely means a lot and, and definitely gives me a lot of confidence going forward and um, I suppose you've probably seen over the few games that we've got a lot of people going through the midfield now as well. So um, it's a really different mix in there and um, that will definitely help the team a lot. Do you like being challenged by taking the most dangerous player at times from the opposition? Yeah, definitely. I think it's a great challenge and um, definitely last year I learned so much playing off some of the, the best players and best mids in the game. Um, that can definitely help, help my game and um, help me become a more consistent player. What about your contract, mate? Was this a, an easy decision? Yeah, definitely. Again, I no place I'd rather be than here. I've um, going into my sixth season, and um, yeah, the club are happy to sign me on. So um, yeah, definitely. And um, no, I love Adelaide and, and love living over here as well. So it's good. So what are you um, as a midfielder? Your take away from when you look at Melbourne and then what the Western Bulldogs were, um, did in that preliminary final? Yeah, what do you what do you kind of see improvement for you as a midfielder looking at them? Yeah, I, I always sort of look at the best mids in the game and um, and what they're doing and trying to implement in your game. So um, we've worked really hard in, on pre-season and as I said before, we've got a lot of lot of people going through the midfield now and um, it's a really good mix in there. And um, I think, yeah, you've got, obviously got Zach and, and Rosie and, and Houston as well going through there. So as I said, it's a really good mix. How has like, just having Zach, Connor and yeah, Dan come in, change the mix of the midfield from 2021? Yeah, it's just brought a, a whole new dynamic. I think you see the way they use the ball and um, they're running carry and, and things like that. It just it just adds a, another dimension to the midfield and um, yeah, it's, it's really exciting. Seven of the boys have re-signed in the past couple of days. What's that say about the club? Yeah, it's massive. Obviously, yesterday the three boys who haven't even played a game yet, they've signed on and um, they're three Victorian boys as well. So it says a lot about the club and, and the culture that we have here and um, it's just a really great, great place to be. Um, everyone wants to improve, wants to get better. So. Um, yeah, again, it's, it's, um, it's a really good place to be.